Hello, this is Nick with NicksComputerFix.com and here's a video on how to download and install Windows Movie Maker on your Windows laptop or tablet. Okay, let's go ahead and get started by opening up an internet browser from your start screen or from your desktop in Windows 8.1 and in this case I'm going to open it up from the desktop so I popped over to the desktop there and I'm going to go down here on the taskbar and just open up internet browser um, IE and I have my default uh, search engine Google and I'm going to start typing in Windows Movie Maker and once I do you can see that down below we have Windows Movie Maker here and I'm going to click on Get Movie Maker and that will take me to the Microsoft Windows Movie Get Movie Maker um, web page and uh, if you wanted to go directly to this web page just uh, make note of this address right here and uh, I'll put that in my description on my video now uh, down here under operating system this is good for Windows 8.1, Windows 8 and Windows 7 Make note that this is Windows Movie Maker 2012. They haven't come out with a 2013, 14, or 15 version as yet. Once you um, decide to get this, go ahead and click on Get It Now. And that takes you to um, the point where on in Windows um, IE, I get this little prompt down here. And um, I'm going to click on Save and that will download that to my computer. And then I'm going to, once it says complete it, I can go ahead and click on run. And then it'll start up the user account control prompt, which says, um, do I authorize this to happen? And I'm going to say yes, because I do want uh, the um, Windows Movie Maker program to download onto my computer. And it starts the installation of Windows Essentials. Now keep in mind, uh, Windows Essentials includes Windows Movie Maker. And it also includes um, Messenger, Photo Gallery, um, Mail, and uh, Microsoft OneDrive, and uh, Outlook Connector Pack as well. Now if you don't want all of that, installed you can choose the program you want to install and I'm gonna do that right there by clicking on that now I'm gonna uncheck all the programs that I do not want to install because it in this um, video tutorial I'm just gonna install Windows Movie Maker and that's the way you do it so Windows Movie Maker is checked and once it is checked and the only one that is checked is Windows Movie Maker I can go down here and I can click on install and that will begin the installation of Windows Movie Maker now as you can see it says installing Windows Essentials uh, 2012 but the only program I selected out of the package was Windows Movie Maker so that's the only program that's going to be installed um, during the install process here um, on my Windows uh, laptop. And keep in mind the speed and performance of your laptop computer determines how quickly um, the install will complete. Alright, mine is done and it tells me Windows Essentials is, uh, in, is finished being installed so I'm going to go ahead and click on close and I'm going to close out um, IE Internet Explorer I use Internet Explorer because it's the default for Windows 8.1, but you can use Firefox or another um, um, Explorer if you chose to. I'm going to go over to the Start screen because I'm going to open up Windows Movie Maker by going down here and clicking on the down arrow, and that takes me to the Apps screen, and alphabetically under M, I can see that uh, Movie Maker is listed now and I'm going to go ahead and click on Movie Maker and that will open up uh, Windows Movie Maker on my Windows 8.1 desktop for me where you can go ahead and begin using Windows Movie Maker and creating your masterpiece movie now before I end this tutorial let me show you one little trick um, that you can use to quickly open up uh, Windows Movie Maker within Windows 8.1 and what we're going to do is go down to the taskbar down here and we're going to right click on the Windows Movie Maker icon and we're going to click and say 
pin this program to taskbar. Now once we do that, if you close out Windows Movie Maker, and you'll be able to at any time open it up quickly because um, the icon will remain permanently on your taskbar and one click opens it up. So let's go ahead and close that and uh, that way you don't have to go over here to your star, uh, window start screen click on your down arrow and go over here and click on movie maker to open it up on your desktop all right um, that's the end of this tutorial subscribe and like my video